Like, like I'm tired of you eating seafood every day. I think a lot of women right now are really fed up with men not being able to communicate. Communication is very simple. Um, I feel like men make it so complicated when it's really easy. You know, it's 2022. Uh, we all know how to send a text message. Y'all can check your fantasy uh, team and scores and whatnot. You can send your lady a text and say, hey, you know what? I'm going to be with the boys today. We watching football. I'm not really going to, you know, be texting you back and forth. But if you need me, holler. Like, it's really that simple. Or I'm at work. I have, you know, a lot of clients today. And I won't really be able to talk to you until later on. But I will give you a call when I'm off work. That's a simple text message. A lot of men feel like it's called checking in. It's not called checking in. It's called communicating. It's called communicating. And it's by far the most bare minimum thing that you should be doing while you're courting someone or while you're in a relationship with them. You sh the woman or the other person should never be left wondering what you're up to while you're not communicating with them. See, if you communicate before you do something and you start getting busy and then you forget, then you won't have those problems that you have. Y'all won't get in an argument because you never told her that you were going out with your boys and y'all was going to be, you know, out for hours upon hours and she wasn't going to hear from you or get that daily phone call. So again, I'm just going to say this, fellas, y'all got to start communicating. A lot of the problems that you have with your significant other will disappear once y'all start learning how to communicate. Okay. Number one reason, this is the only biggest reason that we guys suck at communicating with women. Women don't listen. Da -da. women don't listen women don't listen the funny thing is that the divorce ends two reasons divorce i think the top two reasons why divorce um is initiated nowadays is um finances and communication it's hilarious to me women don't listen women want men that are leaders but they don't want to listen to the leaders that they pick These women go pick a man and they want a leader, a dom so-called a dominant leader. They get that dominant leader and they don't want to listen. But these are the same people that preach communication, communication. He communicates what should happen in this relationship. You argue his communication. <laughs> you argue his talking points. You argue his logic. You argue his reasons. You argue his everything he forms in the relationship. You argue it. So I don't get the communication part. A lot of us guys don't want to be your therapist. And I will always say this. When you date a woman, you become her therapist. She does not want solutions. She just want to vent to you. And a lot of guys get exhausted. You'll sit there. She want to talk about this. She want to talk about that. She want to talk about this. She want to talk about that. You're like, okay, this is what comes with being in a relationship. But most of us guys want solutions and we can't find solutions when we deal with women because women don't like solutions. If y'all did, y'all would ask us how to date. If women wanted solutions, y'all be like, you know what? We're all going to just say, let the man tell us how to date so we can find other men. Y'all will listen to us when we say don't go out there, dress a certain type of way. Y'all will listen to us when we say don't collect a lot of bodies, not good for your health or you in general, because women will say you don't know what I've been through. It must be with some guys that you shouldn't be with, right? It don't matter. You know, it was just life lessons, but I would have told you not to do it. And she'll be like, it happened. And, it, you know, it, it's, it's just life lessons. And she'll do it again. Then do it again. Then do it again. Women don't listen. And if any woman want to be like, well, Sean, guys don't listen. A man's not supposed to listen to a woman. <laughs> you want a leader, right? If you got to tell the leader how to be a leader, then he's not a leader. I'm not saying you can't give men advice, but if women sit here and say, well, Sean, I'm going to argue your point by saying that men don't listen. A man's not supposed to listen to a woman. You want a leader that listens to you. He's not a leader. It makes no sense for you to argue my point by saying, well, Sean, he don't listen either. 
what type of woman want to date a man that listen to her every single time? And people will be like, well, Sean, maybe she's talking about just talking, you listen to her. No, no, no. She wants you to listen to her commands. She's not going to give you talking points. She's going to give commands. I want you to do this. I want a man like this. I want you to. This. So she wants you to listen to that and actually act on the things she tell you. So she will be leading you. If a man tells you this is the type of woman I'm going to deal with, this is all my standard stuff like that, a woman has to follow if you want to be with that man because he's the leader that you want, right? But that man don't have to follow what you want. You got to understand it because he's the leader. So if there's one leader and there's one follower, there's the chain of command. But for some odd reason, there's a partnership. There's a 50-50. All this nonsense. And then when this man listens to you, you leave him. And you say, he suck at communication. No, no, no. You wanted a leader. You met a leader. It doesn't make sense how y'all always name something and want something. But y'all don't know how to work with that something. And I, like I said, guys, <laughs> these women, you know, like I said, they, they, some of them are just going to be single for a long period of time. But you don't sit here and listen to women tell you how to do things. She's going to lead their relationship to the end. and. A lot of these women are false advertising. So you got to understand to pick and choose wisely and just pay attention to who you're dating. Because communication is, I don't even know how that's the number two reason. Women suck at communicating. They tell you, you should know how I feel. How will I know how in the world you feel? <laughs> how will I know? Oh, you know, you should, you should just know. You should know when a guy is treating you bad or good, but you got your behind beat up every single day and you still thought he loved you. Common sense would have told you that man beat your behind every day. You shouldn't be with that man. But well, you, you don't understand the relationship. I understand somebody beating me up is not right. <laughs> That's common sense. So common sense don't apply to you then. So it's hard to have conversation with this woman. Especially when most of them are victim mindset women. They have victim mindsets. So you can't really have a real conversation because we have to walk on eggshells. I don't want to say this because she's going to be sensitive. I don't want to say this because it's going to be disrespectful. Like every little thing, we can't even tell you when you're overweight. Most of y'all don't want to speak about your age. I don't know how communication is the number two reason or the number one reason of divorce. I think it's the probably number two because number one is finances. So I don't understand that because women suck at communication. Suck at it. Oh, it's the guys. No. The guy is trying to have regular conversation with a rational human being. But sadly, we are rational human beings, logical human beings, and women are emotional human beings. So it's hard to communicate with y'all, not with each other. We can have a regular conversation with a guy. But with y'all, we have to, oh, you know, think about her feelings. Think about how she's going to take it and stuff like that. It's nonsense. Y'all suck at communication. Y'all don't communicate good with each other. Women lie to women. <laughs> Women lie to women, but y'all, you know, when it comes to guys, oh, y'all suck at communication. Y'all lie to each other. Like, comment, subscribe.